What's going on everyone? This is Jack with the Trading Tribe and today we are back at it with another trade recap. Um, this is actually a day trade that I'm currently in. So I wanted to review my latest trade on natural gas futures. So we'll see I'm on ticker symbol NG, which is the continuous contract within Thinkorswim. Um, on the left hand side, we can see that gas has been in a really clean downtrend on the hourly chart. So ever since gas hit those highs of around 3.15, we've actually turned around and have begun this hourly downtrend. And so, you know, based on kind of how we attacked the uptrend, it's very similar, but it's just the, the opposite, right? When gas is starting to trend lower, all we're really doing on the swing trading side is we're waiting for these extensions and then waiting for times to kind of pile in and short. So we'll notice the last few weeks shorting these pops around the 100 moving average have been extremely profitable um, and extremely good trades. And so all that really happened this morning is we bounced, right? We bounced all the way up to the 100. As we can see, Monday of this week, right, we had a really nice up day, um, which was counter trend, but we took advantage of those buys as well. And then we'll notice, right, we got up to that 2385 level, which happens to be that 100 SMA as well. And I can put this on our chart just to show it. So in Thinkorswim, we can add this daily SMA indicator. And then we can basically pick whatever time frame we want. So if we want to add this moving average from our hourly chart, we can make this an hourly um, chart. And then we can make this a 50 day moving average. And it'll actually be the 100. And there we go. So we can see this moving average right here, which is the 100, my apologies. Um, we can see we're bumping right up into that. And that's where that bullish momentum stopped. Again, right, this is exactly where it stopped last time as well. So at the very beginning of July, we can see the last really large down move on gas also begun from the 100 moving average. So this is really just us coming back up to that 100 hour um, simple moving average and rejecting again. And so all I did today was I noticed, okay, we are failing the 100 hour moving average again. This is a great time to get into a swing trade. Right, we can take a entry with a very tight stop. So my stop you can see is just over that last set of highs. I entered on this lower low to wait for some confirmation. Um, very small profits for now. So I'm only up about seven um, ticks on it right now, but I did have an entry around 2.36. Two so you'll notice right around that lower low is what tagged me in with a really, really tight risk. And if this trade does go to plan, right, we can fall about a thousand dollars. So if we do fall down to that lower low around 2.27, it offers around a thousand dollars, right? We're really not risking much either. We're risking about a hundred and forty dollars for a thousand dollars in this case. So wanted to show you how I can find these really nice risk to reward plays on gas. This could turn into more of a swing trade on gas. It just depends. Some of these drops actually have occurred really quickly. Um, so if this downtrend really picks up today, this could absolutely hit target today. But of course, right with it being in a downtrend, I am aiming for that long term lower low. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. Feel free to also like and subscribe to the channel for a lot more content like this. And we will see you next time. Thanks.